acting a position to organize the polls tomorrow. So as you are aware, the Yes, Kasper. Okay, so you are aware the matter has been discontinued. Lawyers for lawyers for Dr. Dufour announced to the court that they had instructions to discontinue the matter. And so as we speak, the matter has been discontinued. I would like to use this opportunity to thank the Council of Elders of the party, the chairman of the party, the general secretary, for the effort they've put in place in resolving this matter. I also want to thank Dr. Dufour, the presidential candidate, for his magnanimity and to accept to withdraw this matter from court. What this shows is that the NDC is united. Yes. The NDC is forging ahead in the 2024 elections as a united party. Now, as to whether the elections will take place or not, the party has already issued a press statement signed by the general secretary that the elections are coming off tomorrow. And I can announce to the whole of the NDC fraternity that these elections will take place tomorrow, Saturday. The issues concerning the register, have they been resolved? I mean, that is the core issue, reason why uh, Dr. Dufour bring the matter, brought the matter to court. I mean, can you tell us whether you've been able to satisfy his needs in terms of that? Say it again. In terms of the issues surrounding the voters register, the delegates list, has it been resolved? Okay, so he's um, engaging further with uh, some other members here. We'll hear uh, from him again shortly. Uh, the general secretary is here. Uh, we'll just join and pick that particular interview quite shortly and uh, hear on what he has to say on the issues that have come up so far. But I mean, if you are just uh, joining the feed, uh, we heard from the party saying that they are going to hold it. So let's listen to what the general secretary has to say. All right. Uh, yeah, so uh, we, are, we are happy that uh, uh, the plaintiff have decided to discontinue the case. Uh, that opens the door for us to be able to proceed with the, with the elections tomorrow. Uh, so we want to use the opportunity to send a message to all the rank and file across all the country, all our delegates, all our aspirants, that uh, we, are, we are ready to go right ahead with the elections tomorrow. Uh, so we're going to immediately uh, get in touch with the Electoral Commission and arrange that the, all the logistics are able to reach to the places that they ought to reach. Uh, so uh, thank you. Thank you all of you for, 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 I mean, for, for, for the cooperation. You represent the party. There were some issues that the before come raisable with the came to court. Subsequently, that has been withdrawn. Uh, have you satisfied the requests that they made to which they came to court? Yeah, it's been satisfied. Um, the delegate list is the main primary uh, document that we are depending on. And this delegate list has been ready, made available to all the contestants. So really, as far as we are concerned, there really was no case to begin with. But uh, we are happy that didn't serve, decided to be drawn. The Electoral Commission stated that it would be difficult for them to be able to... I've already, I've already explained that uh, we will make sure every assistance is provided for the materials to reach in good time. Do you have any other thing with respect to the fact that there may also be delays as a result of what has transpired? We will ensure that all the materials are there on time. When would elections be started tomorrow? Same time. Same time. Same time as in what? From 7 o'clock. 7 to 4. That's the same time. Nothing has changed. Everything is on course. All right. Thank you.